Fast forward to April 2015 and we get DLC back too. Yeah, they originally planned this for May 2015 and then it released a week earlier. I mean, probably because Nintendo had nothing better to do in this era, they were barely releasing games. The theme of this wave was Animal Crossing. It's worth noting around this time that fans had been rampantly anticipating a new Animal Crossing game for the Wii U. Pilger made it to Smash, there was an Animal Crossing Plaza app, and now the girl and boy villagers. There was Isabella from New Leaf and a track were in Mario Kart 8 now. A hot diggity dog, Animal Crossing must be coming this has to be some sort of wild promotion for a new game we all said yeah nintendo hates us all we got was amiibo festival so i really don't know why they promoted animal crossing so heavily here but hey it made for a banger dlc pack we got the two villager genders and isabel who was a new character from new leaf the final character was dry bowser which yeah i mean it's certainly a clone but at least he was a new character from the mainline games where's the mario game where you meet pink gold peach huh it's right it doesn't exist alongside this pack you know, more me customs who cares wait wait a minute is that a pikmin costume Quite literally out of nowhere with this update, Nintendo would add a 200cc mode to Mario Kart 8, making it the fastest racing in the entire franchise to this day. This received quite a mixed reception at the time. It's important to note that this wasn't actually paid DLC, but was a free update regardless if you paid for the packs or not, so it ultimately meant more people would complain about it. 200cc is very hard, no doubt about it, but I really think a lot of the difficulty came from the fact that no one tried to use the brake. To some degree, you can't blame the players entirely for that. In 150cc, you basically just hold A the entire time and very rarely press the B button. It's hard, sure, but there's more than enough wiggle room to get a feel for it. But that requires, uh, F... 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 Fort? E... E... Fort? No, oh, yeah, these tracks were definitely not tailored for this at all, and some of them, like Mario Kart 64 Rainbow Road, were as about as long as this sentence. I feel like seriously getting mad about any of this is nonsensical, as it's optional, but when has that ever stopped anyone from saying anything?